really in the last 10 to 15 minutes, police wrapping up here, but they were out here for over six hours. Now, they say two officers opened fire, killing that 37-year-old man. And at last update, the chief saying they're not releasing his name until they notify his family, but they say he had a long criminal history and committed a crime just a few days ago. Shattered glass and bullet holes left in the silver sedan after Fairfax County police officers shoot and kill a wanted man. Investigators working well into the evening, taking pictures and collecting evidence after they say officers were forced to fire. Our three Fairfax County police officers told our gunman at least 20 times to drop his gun. He didn't. I don't know why he didn't. Around 4.30 Thursday afternoon, the parking lot of the Springfield Town Center turning into a crime scene. This was the view from above from Chopper Ford not long after the fatal shots fired. Fairfax County Police say that 37-year-old suspect had a history with law enforcement, and there was a warrant out for his arrest from an incident Sunday. He stole a handgun from a family member of his here in Fairfax County, fired that weapon inside of their house, and then fled on foot. Investigators tracking down that suspect in this mall parking lot days later. And police say as officers approached, he got into his car and pulled out a gun. At least one of the officers yelled out to the other officers that he could see a gun in his hand. At that point, they continued to tell him to drop the weapon. A short time later, after he didn't drop the weapon, our officers discharged, two out of the three officers discharged their firearms, striking the 37-year-old gunman. That man taken to the hospital where he died, and police say the killer confrontation was all captured on body cam. Our gunman was armed with this firearm, and we have recovered it from the scene. Back out here live, and the chief says they will release that body cam video sometime in the next 30 days. Reporting live in Springfield, Doreen, back to you. All right, quite a scare for anybody who was trying to do some shopping over there today. Walter Morris, thank you.